everybody. Happy Tuesday. Hope that all are well. Um, so we gathered last night, uh, Channel 451 did a Tunnel Talk episode, and this has happened a couple of times before where we record something and then the following day or shortly after that, Detroit City announces something, something big. Um, in this case, a loan signing announcement. Um, somebody that makes his way from FK Pirate of Beatse of the Czech First League, but somebody that City fans will have already recognized as somebody that is a prominent figure um, foe against us the last couple of years, and that is Laurent Kisiedu, um, a 25-year-old attacking midfielder, um, originally Ivory Coast, dual U.S. and Ivory Coast citizen, Cote d'Ivoire, also is known as, um, who's featured the last three seasons before this year with Memphis 901 in USL Championship, somebody that is play in an attacking role, either centrally left or right. Um, featured prominently the last three seasons in Memphis 901 uh, under uh, both Ben Pierman before Pierman's moved to Charleston as well as Stephen Glass. And somebody that I think could be another spark in this midfield. So our guess is in what it's looking like from, you know, from our discussion with Sean Spence, well, Sean Spence's take is he could see Maxi Rodriguez moving back into that more central double pivot role that we're starting to see him play again um, and what he was commonly playing before the start of this season. Kisiedu's deal is through the rest of this season, a loan deal, and he is going to be wearing number 70. He is with the team already um, and will be available for selection uh, in the club's matchup tomorrow night in St. Petersburg, Florida against Tampa Bay Rowdies. So he probably traveled with the team on the flight today. So um, be very excited to see how he features in another big talent. Um, they already bolstered the ranks with Jesse S. Daniel a few weeks ago. Um, I know I think Lai's job has had a knock, so I wonder if that's been part, part another part of the reason on here. But it'll be interesting to see how big of an impact he can make already in this side. So we welcome Laurent uh, to Detroit City. Uh, again, Laurent Cassiedu, uh newest announcement by Detroit City loan acquisition from FK Padovice in the Czech First League. Wearing the number 70 and he's available for selection for tomorrow night's game against the Tampa Bay Rowdies. So have a great night everybody. Um, the latest episode of 451 Tunnel Talk should be dropping if not tonight then tomorrow morning before the matchup. Um, and there will be a fun one and yeah we'll keep you posted on anything else that comes up. In the meantime we go on for it. Everyone again to continue the news of Detroit City just announcing everything on Tuesday. Um, we announced earlier today Laurent Cassiedu, um, the club was announced by the club as the latest loan acquisition for the rest of this year. The club also announced Detroit City that is their um, new assistant coach in Nick Dasovich, um, who has had plenty of um, experience both as a player and as a coach. Um, Canadian national team midfielder, somebody who's a feature um, coaching uh, different age groups in the Canadian national team, as well as heavily with the Vancouver Whitecaps, um, playing for them in, when they were in the USL, and also being involved with them as in the coaching ranks where the academy to MLS Next Pro, um, as well as having an interim stint at Toronto FC in September 2010 until January 2011. Around the same time, Danny DiGio was at Toronto as well. So, um, Dasovich uh, serves as basically replacing Yanni Michaels, who depart, part left the club for Besiktas in Turkey a couple months ago. So, we welcome Nick to this team, and let's see if there's any more news that the club decides to put out before this day's end. Uh, but yeah, in the meantime, happy Tuesday, everybody. We go on.